Oh, this is a uh, paladin here doing the uh, the strum card keep with the ogres. This is quite a scary quiz. I, when I went here in Wawa, Wild Wild, dude, I got it first try, easy clap. But let's see what happens. There's no audio in any of these right now, guys. Okay, it's fine. Yeah, these ogres, they, they pop like a enrage where they walk really, really slow, but they hit really hard. You, pref you really want to kite them during this because they just slap, right? You, you, you don't even need to slow them to kite because they slow themselves kind of, right? There's the bop going off into a holy light. He says, I'm fucked. Oh, gosh. And now you're coming to running. Okay, you do have a lay on hands in case things get south. Potion was just used as well. You don't have repentance. Oh, God. Dude, you're just running, man. You're running for your life. The little, ba little semi back jumping. Okay, that's good. Trying to face them so you don't get dazed. Lay on hands. Oh my god. Can lay on hands with a debuff? Of course you can. You, you can lay on hands with debuff in vanilla. You, you don't need to have forbearance up to lay on hands in vanilla. Okay. There was the lay on hands and he's kiting out. Oh my god. Dude, you're so lucky your lay on hands was up, man. I mean, you made it out, man. You committed to, this, you committed to running away and you actually made it out. 51 warrior death searing gorge. Don't tell me you're gonna jump in like that. Why would you charge? Please charge. What? Why would you do that? Do you have retaliation up? No, you don't have retaliation. Nifty stopwatch, bro. Freedom! <laughs> Freedom! Oh my, why would you do that? Yeah, so, so he, he jumped in, which is fine to do. Just wanna, if you do this charge though, what? Yeah, so this is a way to get... So instead of running through the, Nerub, the Nerubian cave, you can go up the mountain, I guess. This is right so far? Okay. Yeah, and you get behind. Look at this. Wicked. So this is to save time instead of running through the Nerubian cave or running all the way down through western, eastern Plagueland, sorry. Dude, people will do anything not to run around that mountain, you're right. 19 seconds left on slow fall. Drop down and make your way to no! No! You... You don't just blindly listen to Tommy's alarmy, man! Oh my god, dude! You had it too! This is a level 57 character, basically 58. Pretty much about the thing. Oh. Drop down. I, it's, I think it's because he wanted to drop down on this. That's what he meant, right? Drop, drop down here. Make your way to Tyrion. <gasps> dude, the sound. <gasps> Man! Oh my, that sucks, man. Is this another person doing a skip? Where are we? Oh, so they're going... Okay, they want to go to the uh, the Soram Strand right there. And instead of running down here and then up, they want to run... They want to cut through the cave or like through the mountains here. There is a very steep fall here, though. At the health point, it's very big and very red. Yeah, you, dude, oh. go back. No. Oh, they're a duo. Oh, wait. Uh. No, go back. Mr. Donut, don't be a donut. Oh. Yeah, don't be a donut. Oh. Don't! Oh. <laughs> dude, your, your warrior friend oh. can't do that. Yeah, I don't like these drops. Oh, you drop. How'd you get over there? S Ghost Wolf, he doesn't have that. Ghost Wolfie. <gasps> oh. I'm not. Donuts! Oh I'm my dead. god, David. Fuck. <laughs> what? Oh. Yep. My. David! Yeah. David! Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> Yo! Bro! Oh. Did he just fall to his death? He just fell to his death. David. How? Why? What? Is... Okay, to be fair, you baited David, okay? 
with like jumping down to that little rock there when you know you have ghost full of he, he doesn't that was bait for david this jump oh, right there when he made that <laughs> he barely made the jump oh, yeah, yeah a way you can do this i see he has swiftness potions give some swiftness potions to david so we can use that for the jump or as kasaki in the chat said duel david before you jump down and then you make the jump and then david jumps off the mountain and charges you in the air to get up on the platform as well that's the way to do it. But David, if in the chat, man. Somebody can write a four fucking paragraph, uh, you know, response. Okay. About how, how you're wrong. Yeah, it's the silver button, exactly, MJ's. People, which is kind of indicative that they don't care about that person. Uh -huh. they okay. Want the Subscribed. Thank they you. They care. They'd be advocating for people to stop drinking. So, okay. Yeah. If the uh, if it if. Oh no! No, what's gonna happen? The, the fire nova. Oh! One minute or less clips. People would know that I actually said this exact. I love how he's mousing Is over. All by yourself, oh! Like oh! He like realized that. That's a rip, man. That's a rip, dude. Those these trolls though, these shamans, they slap, man. They have the fire nova thing right there. They have like an enrage, plus they have like a lightning shield. They do so much damage. It's ridiculous. Yeah, and as they as you said, no matter they can combo it up, so they can do like a uh, enrage into the fire nova into the damage, right? Oh, this is right before Baron Gittin. Okay. Oh my god, dude, this... Okay, Hosido, man. I know you're a healer, dude, but dude, this goddamn raid frame is literally covering half the screen. Okay, how... Oh, don't tell me he's gonna get... Because he's a healer. The only way you can die here is... Oh, the over aggro! Don't stay here, Hosido! Run out, run out! Run, 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 run! <gasps> oh, see what's happening, Jesus! Move the boss back, dude, dude. Guys, we got this. Everyone, back to your spot. Go. Heal yourself if you need. Oh, rip! Evade out, dude. Range, get on the sack. Everyone, to your spot. Why me, <laughs> dude? Yeah. So uh, I think it was a hunter who over aggroed, right? Pull him back a bit oh, further. Shit. Yeah, it was a hunter, right? That's good. Like it? Yep. Yep. Well, yeah, I think yeah, Orador. So it was a hunter called Orador that over aggroed. And then Baron Giddon went into the raid, used the. Uh, I don't know if I remember what this is called. Uh, the thing where he cast the fire thing, like the, the pulsing stuff. It doesn't do any damage in the beginning, but at the last, like, three ticks, they do, like, 3k damage each. So you can stay in in the beginning and it's fine, which is what he did to heal people. He stayed in to heal, right? But you can't stay in there, man, because it does so much ramping damage. Oh. Look at the health. Like, in the beginning, it Where doesn't do going? a lot. <laughs> Bro, those ticks, man. <gasps> Dude, one, two, three, four, five, almost six people died to that right there. Holy... Okay, so they're selling to the plugger. That's fine. If the rogue pickpockets here, then he's gonna go crazy mode and everybody will be hostile. Depends on how... The, the, depends on the way that you do this. Okay, so the hunter's going over here, so I, I think they are gonna do pickpocket, right? I really hate to do B or D as a rogue. It's my fifth run, and all I got is this. Handmaster's bow. Okay. What the hell just happened over there? Wait, how did they... Who the hell pulled all that? Oh my god, bro. What? May just ba basically did... Druid is basically almost dead, but they're just running off now. Oh, this mage right here is in big trap. Big trap. Who pulled that? The rogue was just sitting there complaining about the loot and then somebody went and pulled all the patrons. Oh, wait, that inferal ass. Play pal white, that is the druid. So the druid died. 
Did he hearthstone and then die to a dot? Okay, mage is out as well. I, I think maybe he hearthstone out and then died. No, is that the corpse over there? Yeah, that's the corpse right there above my cam. Some dungeons are in weird places on the actual map. Okay, so it just shows Feral Ass. Okay. The, the priest, the druid, and the mage is at the plucker guy. Oh, it was the mage. Okay, so the mage... Did he... What's that ability? 25 damage. The mage used some sort of AoE ability, I think. It, there's a frosty buff, so I assume... I, my first assumption was a Nova or a Cock, right? But it's 25 damage, so maybe it's like a rank 1 uh, Frostbolt, or maybe a rank 1 Nova? It, it, the mage definitely pulled. Okay. Dude, the, the rogue is still, like, typing as this is happening. Wait, he tr did he try to bring them over to these guys? I don't know if it was- maybe it was a grief, I'm not sure. He just right-clicked. Oh, maybe he- maybe the mage accidentally right-clicked. And then the uh, the debuff that we saw on Plucker was the uh, ice armor, right? Or whatever it is. This, this thing? I don't know if that, like, activates that. We- I mean, we don't- I can't really see what's happening, so we don't know if it was on purpose or not, right? He might just have fat-fingered, like, an ability. I know that way too well, guys. That could happen. Yeah, it, it might have just been a misclick. I mean, it happens, you know? If you fat finger like an AoE right there, it's ogre, right? Like, you're done. What happened? He said, holy fuck. I'm so sorry, guys. I simply misclicked. Yeah, I mean, it happens. Okay. Frostbolting this mob here. Nice. Maybe be a little bit careful about the other mob that's pathing in now, because these mobs do hurt. I want to see a sheep on the other mob. Yes. Yeah. Good tap target. Nice polymorph. Good. Tap targeting like a pro. Amazing. Maybe put a little healing pot on yourself. Yes. Yeah, healing, healing pot. Okay. Finish off the mob. Maybe, 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 healing, healing pot. Healing pot. I think it is safe to say that, honestly, they did the best that they could. And uh, they did really, really valiantly in this instance right here. Uh, sheeped the off target and did massive DPS on the main target as well. Uh, it appears there was some lag with the, the healing pot as well, which was unfortunate. And, and, and I think the sheep fell off early because uh, of like a heartbeat. So, uh, honestly, really bad RNG here, guys, for Nubius Magus, but 49 is very commendable. Uh, the average hardcore player probably gets to level 14, so this guy is actually very, very gamer.